So this past weekend, Quinnell, uh, women from all over the country, all over the world, wanted to get together. They wanted to send a clear message to Americans about how women want to be respected, how women want to be focused on. And I think that's a good idea. But these particular, this particular group of women, the, the ones that we hear most about, must be all of the freaks in the United States and around the world, including Madonna, who stands up there in front of all these ladies and says that she's angry, really angry, and was actually thinking about, at one point, blowing up the White House, bombing the White House. Now, can you imagine, Quan LX, if you or me said anything to that degree, our hands would be placed behind our backs and our fannies were going to be taken to jail for a period but of time. Madonna, on the other hand, was applauded. What Madonna said was absolutely wrong. There have been people who've been arrested for saying much less about the White House. I believe what Madonna said was very irresponsible. I understand the sentiment and the spirit behind what she said because many women in this country are angry with the sexism that is coming out of the mouth of Donald Trump and the unapologetic sexism that comes out of his mouth when he calls it just locker room talk. Do you see the hats? When it's really more than that. You see the hats with but little kitty ears on them? But Matt, let me say this. I gotta use the word kitty. I wish that we could get that many women to march about the issue of domestic violence in America. Every week that we're turning on the TV, we see men killing their girlfriends and killing their wives. And you can't get a half a million women to protest that. I believe there should be women standing up by the tens of thousands that will speak out against women like Amber Rose when she has to slut walk and say women should be proud to dress like sluts. I believe that is sending a worse message and not fighting against domestic violence collectively as women well, should. But look who you've got. That's sending a worse message than what Donald Trump is saying and then come out of his mouth. Look, it isn't anything to do with Trump. Look at what you got. You've got these movie star women who don't live the same lives as, as most of the women. You've got women that have been around since the 60s doing the same thing. God bless them, but it's time to get some new individuals that can talk about what's taking place in 2017. These women that are speaking have no idea what it's like to be a real woman. They don't represent <clears throat> the real women. Matt. They leave there and they go back to their mansions. Hold on, Matt. First of all, you and I as men are not qualified to say what makes a woman a real woman or not. So I want to make sure that we're very careful about that. But I believe that there are some more pressing issues that women are facing in this nation much more dangerous than Donald Trump. And I think that you should take that collective energy and that mobilization effort like you did in D.C. and mobilize against domestic violence and violence against women. Because it's teenage young girls, it's girlfriends and wives that are being murdered by men in domestic right. violence, and it's not getting enough attention. Well, then let's get Madonna and these other women out of there and put women in there that truly understand, and maybe that message will get across. I just think women shouldn't say what Madonna had to say but women need to stand up about some more serious issues and much more serious than Donald Trump, but stand against Trump also because that's unapologetic sexism coming out of his mouth.